Getting your science research published while you're still in high school is an Ivy League admissions hack, but most people have no clue how to actually do that. So I'm going to walk you guys through exactly how you can get your name on a published paper so you can get into an Ivy League school. The first thing you have to realize is that most research done by high school students will not help you get into an Ivy League school. Words like meta-analysis or lit review are just code words for a summary of other research papers. That's not original research and Ivy League colleges are not impressed by that. What you want to do to actually get into these schools is be part of an original research project. And what that means oftentimes is not doing it alone. If you want your research to stand out to Ivies, you need a mentor. Now, a mentor is a person who's a PhD, a real scientist studying this field. And this helps you in two ways. First, real journals will actually accept a paper with a mentor as a first author. You don't need to be the first author on the paper for it to be impressive. You could just have a support role in a project that's already ongoing. And the second is that that mentor can also write you a letter of recommendation. You can attach it along with the letters from your teachers when you apply to one of these colleges. And finally, if you do a real project with a real mentor on a real research question, you'll be able to submit it to competitions like ICEF and Regeneron STS. These are really prestigious science research competitions that will help you stand out in the admissions process. And if you have an original paper, you're going to stand out from all the other kids who are submitting. And that's it. That's how you would do real science research and have it actually make an impact on your Ivy League application. Now, if you have questions about how you would actually do anything, in this process, go ahead and drop those in the comments and I'll see you guys there.